Hello everyone, I am Ghulam Abbas. I hope you guys are fine and doing great. In this video, I am going to show you how you can enable and use Clipboard in Windows 11. Now the thing is that Clipboard was introduced in Windows 10 uh, version 1809 and since then it is quite a handy feature if you want to uh, paste a single file or text or uh, a picture in multiple places. So to get started, let's just go ahead and start it. And the very first thing is open the Windows settings and then scroll down to the end, sorry, under the system, scroll down to the end and choose clipboard. Okay, from here you can just simply click uh, here and now the clipboard is turned on. Uh, you can also turn on using the uh, Windows this V and you can see that the clipboard is open and now simply click turn on and now you can see that the clipboard is turned on. So basically this page, a small page that you are looking in this site, uh, it is basically known as the uh, clipboard history where it is showing you that how many files have you copied here and the maximum 25 entries it can accept the most. More than 25 it is going to delete them one by one from the end. So you can uh, copy picture uh, or a video as, as long as they are to 4 MB and so let's just go ahead and let's see how it is going to work suppose i'm opening this post download windows 11 iso image it is inside the intozone.com i am going to simply copy this bit up as text control c or right click on it and choose copy and now you can see that if i have to press windows v on the keyboard it is copied here how about the next thing the next line again control c and now you can see that uh, press windows v this line is also copied if you want to pin a single text multiple times there just simply uh, click pin and now you can see that it this is uh, basically pinned suppose i'm going to copy this one Control c and again press windows view on the keyboard you can see that it's still this is pinned here so you can just simply use it anywhere you want suppose i want to use it here and just simply press windows v and paste this one now you can see that that thing is available this is how you can basically uh, copy a text but when it comes to picture how you can copy a picture inside the clipboard now that is a good question now uh, suppose i am going to copy this uh, file from here suppose the battery report just right click on it and choose copy this is the copy icon in windows 11. now if i have to click copy and check the windows clipboard you can see that there is not a picture unfortunately available in the clipboard now when you're trying to copy a picture in the clipboard it means that you have to use the windows built-in features suppose like uh, i want to take a screenshot of these uh, windows suppose the windows is stored from here just hold windows sorry shift and then print the screen on the keyboard uh, i press those two keys but can see that nothing is happened but when i open the keyboard you can see that the picture has been copied here now you can see that it is part of an item uh i think uh, hold on a moment alt plus print screen also i think it will also copy inside the clipboard yeah you can see that yep that has also been copied that thing here uh but all print screen only copy a single window suppose this one all print screen sorry not windows but all print screen and windows you can see that you can paste it inside any document that you are using so it is quite handy if you uh how about links uh you can also do the same thing with the links as long as they are a part of the uh, they can be copied okay just suppose i'm going to copy this line this link just right click on it and choose copy link address open the windows uh report history and you can see that it is available and what about the entry let's just go ahead entry how many uh, has it copied till now the very most that it can copy is 25 okay just uh, move that here and beside you cannot resize it that is not a very good thing one two three four five six seven eight okay we'll have to make it at least 25 25 that was i think it 
control c copy what about line control c copy 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 how much that is now one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen okay that is sixteen uh how about this one say one teen and then this one eighteen this one nineteen this one twenty this one twenty one this one twenty two this one twenty three and this one twenty four and this one twenty five and finally twenty six let's just go ahead and check out one two three four five six seven eight nine 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, and then 25, 26. That is good. Okay. I think Microsoft has definitely increased the amount of this thing here. Their last one is uh, download Windows 11 ISO image. Control C, copy, and V. So oh, that is 26 the most that you can copy so uh, now there is also some other settings uh, of the clipboard inside basically the clipboard itself if you visit the settings and that is we can share it with the other devices you can just simply just go ahead uh, as long as you you are basically Microsoft account is logged in inside another device on your mobile device or desktop or whatever you can basically share it with them also and from here you can also clear the clipboard history and beside that one you can also clear the clipboard history from here too if you want to clean one of them just simply click and then delete and you can also do the same thing and from here you can also do clear all and that's gone and you may notice here are some uh, basically most recently used emojis or gifs or whatever you can see them they are available here you can also use them as a keyboard but uh not basically they are not basically a part of the clipboard itself they can be used as a part of basically a, like a keyboard touch keyboard or maybe the physical keyboard that's all so this is basically how you can enable the clipboard in windows 11 and how you can use it in windows 11 so i'll meet you guys in the next video